if the idea of losing your phone makes you sweat more than losing your ID, you might be close to nomophobia. That's a concept I came across during the beginning of my PhD. I kept finding studies showing how our emotional regulation is starting to overdepend on that little rectangle. It's not just calls. Your phone is now your memory, your map, your entertainment, your social lifeline. Losing it even briefly can spike anxiety like you've lost part of yourself. And the scarier bit, your brain gets so used to that constant digital comfort that normal life feels unsafe without it. Three ways to stop your phone from being your emotional support. Micro breaks. Leave it in, in another room just for five minutes and build it up. Small exposures reduce the anxiety response. Offline anchors. Carry one non-digital thing you rely on your phone for. Map, notes, watch, so your brain learns it has another safety net. Purposeful use. Big set times to check apps instead of letting notifications summon you like a butler. Your phone should be a tool, not a pacemaker for your nervous system. Otherwise, the moment you lose signal, you'll feel like you've lost a limb. Follow for more on how tech affects your brain.